Hello and welcome to a Tabletop Bellhop board game bag check. I am Mo Tuzano, the Tabletop Bellhop, your cardboard concierge, answering your gaming and game night questions and striving to make everyone's gaming experience better. Today, we're going to a galaxy far, far away, a long time ago, no, we're doing it right now, and checking out what you get in the box for Star Wars Unlock the Escape Game. This is a Escape Room in a Box style game in the Unlock series of games, which is a card-driven escape room game that does also use an app. This particular box set contains three different adventures. We have... Oh, it doesn't say the names. Okay, so we have Play the Rebels, Play the Smugglers, Play the Imperial Agents, which is something that they've been doing for Star Wars games in a while with the three factions. So that's pretty cool. I have not played any of the Unlock games myself, so please, I, I do apologize if I mess something up while talking about the components here. And my goal here is to share what you get in this box without spoiling anything. So fair warning, um, I shouldn't be showing you. I shouldn't be showing you anything you don't want to see. Um, I will try to do my best to not show off anything in here we can't. So I'm going to crack this open. We're going to take a look at what we get in the box for Star Wars Unlocked. So here we have my new copy of Star Wars Unlocked. This was an awesome Christmas gift from my kids who are looking forward to playing this with me. Um, this is a cooperative puzzle game, Escape Room in a Box style game featuring three different stories. This is my first time cracking this open, so we're going to get to see what's in the box for the first time with me here. Again, I don't expect any spoilers. So I guess my first surprise with this already is the size of the box. For Escape Room in a Box style games, I'm used to playing the Exit series of games, and there are much smaller boxes than this. So the first thing we have is... <laughs> cute. Unlock the Escape game in a much closer galaxy. I do like the fact they branded their advertisement to show off um, that, it, that it happens to be a Star Wars game. showing off the other Unlock games. So since Unlock was published, when it was originally released in North America, the games came in small packs with one adventure each. Now they've combined them, so you always get three adventures in one box. So here we have the instructions, which tell you it's for ages 10 and up. It takes about 60 minutes. They say one to six players. Um, that's probably accurate enough, but I, I do worry the more players you have, the more you will get. So it does say, do not look through the card decks before starting play. So fair enough. I won't do that. And there is a solution booklet, so don't look through that. Got it. So there is a 10-card tutorial, and there are three adventures, which are 180 cards. There's a map and a solution booklet for each. So there's Escape from Hoth, An Unforeseen Delay, and Secret Mission on Joha. There is a game overview here. It says each deck of cards provides a cooperative scenario. So I don't, shouldn't have to worry about flipping through this book at all. So we're going to continue on. And there's how to set up the game, the various game rules, which explain how the unlock games work, and the various card types you're going to find while playing through this adventure. Then we have how you will be able to combine two objects together, how you discard cards, the penalties you can get for making mistakes, various modifiers, machines, and codes, hidden objects, hints, and the end of the game. Now note you do need an app to play this, and there is some information here on the app, and how to get hints. So one of the things I have heard are great about these games is the way the app works for hints. And on the back, there is a player aid to show the different card types and the credits. So here is one of the maps. I am not going to crack this open, but we have a map, and then we have a book of step-by-step -step solutions. Again, not going to open it. And then we have a very well-designed, i got to say this is impressive, set of the three cards. So this starts with a tutorial. And then, I, again, I don't want to show anything off here. So one of the things I didn't expect is um, the, the shape of the cards. These are not playing card size. They're taller. Uh, text is very clear on them. Uh, being an older dude, I could appreciate a little bit bigger, but I can read that. Um, this is all in English, so that's worth noting. The cards are not multi-language. This is an English-only game. Uh, it is labeled 1, 2, 3. What's interesting is a spot underneath the potentially old components. But there is nothing but cards in this. So then we have Start Here, which would be probably the second adventure, and Start Here for the last adventure. And then we have, this here has a symbol that says zero. So I have to assume that maybe like the tutorial you would put up here once you get doing it. Now again, I am not going to crack any of these open. I don't want to spoil anything, but I did want you to be able to see what you get, what the component quality was, and what you get in the box for one of these games. What I am going to do, actually, I am going to open one. 
I want to see how thick these cards are. So one of the things that is a bonus, there is a nice quick release open up piece for the cards. And all I want to do here is hold up a card. These are nice. There's there's a nice plastic coating on here. No linen finish. Um, I don't know when you want to flip this over because I noticed there's a map on the other side. I'm trying to show you the card thickness here. Standard playing card, but like like bicycle style playing card. Plasticized, finished. I like it. That that's a nice solid card right there. So there you go. Not going to show you anything else. Not going to open any of these books. Um, one thing I do dig is everything's got a Star Wars look to it. Like, you know, it looks like a, a hollow display. We're not going to look at any map. We're going to put the instructions back on. Put the ad back. And close this up. Until I can sit down with my family and play through Star Wars Unlock the Escape Game. So there you have what you get in the box for Star Wars Unlock the Escape Game, a puzzle and adventure game, a cooperative experience, escape room in a box style experience, 100% card driven. The only components you're going to find in this box, besides like the instructions, is a fold out map and three decks of cards. Now, the big part of this game, of course, is going to be the app integration. And I'm looking forward to trying out the game to see just how well that works. So thank you for joining me as I took a look inside the box of Star Wars Unlock the Escape Game. Now, for my thoughts on this, all you're going to have to do is follow me on social media, Tabletop Bellhop everywhere. Go to our webpage, tabletopbellhop.com, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and listen to our podcast, because I will be reviewing this game as I play through it, and I'll be careful not to spoil anything, so you don't have to worry about that. If you appreciate this video and have checked out our other content and like what we're doing, it'd be awesome if you headed over to patreon.com slash tabletop bellhop and consider tipping your bellhop. For the Tabletop Bellhop Gaming Podcast, I am Mo Tuzno. Good night and game on.